Is it time to buy or sell Microsoft stock? In this video, we're delving into Microsoft. Our initial report was posted on our website on Thursday, April 4th, 2024, and now we're providing you with a more in-depth analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on notifications to stay informed about our latest insights. Stay ahead of potential market changes that could impact your investments. Improve your trading decisions with our new AI. Stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Utilize AI technology for free price predictions and comprehensive analyses of 25,000 global companies today. Please remember that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered financial advice. Since March 12, 2024, our system has identified Microsoft as a buy candidate with a score of 1.78. Now let's delve into the stock's performance over this period. The stock has shown a gain of 0.63%, which translates to an average daily return of 0.04% since being labeled as a buy candidate. The stock is currently in a weak rising trend in the short term, indicating a potential further increase within this trend. Over the next three months, the stock shows a projected 9.39% change, with a potential return ranging from 6.03% to 13.83%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, the trend suggests a 39.18% change, resulting in a possible return between 24.88% and 44.47%. This translates to a price range of $5.21.84 to $7.33 after a year. Our latest update for Microsoft reveals a red day on Thursday as the stock lost 0.611%. The Microsoft stock price declined by 0.611% on Thursday, April 4, 2024, dropping from $4.45 to $4.17.88. This marks the third consecutive day of decline. Throughout the trading day, the stock fluctuated by 2.66% from a low of $4.7.57 to a high of $4.28.67. Over the past 10 days, the price has fallen in eight instances, resulting in an overall decrease of 9.73%. Volume saw a 3 million share increase on the last day, despite falling prices, signaling a potential risk increase in the coming days. A total of 19 million shares were exchanged, amounting to approximately $8.5 billion. Looking back over the past 52 weeks, the stock's highest price reached $430.82, while its lowest was $275.37. Currently, the price sits 3.8% or 12 and 94 cents below the 52-week high of $430.82, which also stands as the all-time high for the stock. Analyst ratings Macquarie upgraded MSFT to outperform with a hold action on Tuesday, April 2, 2024. Morgan Stanley rated MSFT as overweight with a hold action on Monday, April 1, 2024. Jefferies gave MSFT a buy rating with a hold action on Sunday, March 31, 2024. Wedbush upgraded MSFT to outperform with a hold action on Tuesday, March 26, 2024. Oppenheimer rated MSFT as overweight with an upgrade action on Wednesday, Feb 7, 2024. Microsoft stock has received a general strong buy rating from analysts. The P.E. ratio and price to book are both rated as strong buy. In terms of return on investment, analysts also give the stock a strong buy rating. Identified signals for Microsoft. A sell signal was triggered on Thursday, March 21, 2024, resulting in a minus 2.68% decline. Further decrease is expected until a new bottom pivot is determined. Currently, there is a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MAD. Yesterday, volume increased as prices fell, signaling caution. Positive signals are also present, influencing short-term prospects. The stock currently has a sell signal from the short-term moving average, but a buy signal from the long-term average. With the short-term average surpassing the long-term one, a general buy signal is in effect, suggesting a positive outlook. Resistance is expected at around $421.60, with support at approximately $414.39. Breaking through the short-term average will trigger a buy signal, while breaking the long-term average will initiate a sell signal. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. 
moving average convergence divergence, sell signal, pivots, sell signal 10 days ago, Bollinger, buy signal 9 days ago, short-term moving average, buy signal 5 days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal 18 days ago, the relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 16 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, sell signal 2 days ago, the long-term moving average, buy signal 109 days ago, the relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 106 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss levels for Microsoft. Microsoft is currently finding support from accumulated volume at $416.42. This level could present a buying opportunity as an upward reaction is likely when the support is tested. The stock typically exhibits controlled movements and with good liquidity, the risk is considered low. In the last day, the stock had a range of 11 or 10 cents or 2.66% between its high and low points. Over the past week, the stock has shown a daily average volatility of 1.35%. Before discussing potential trading levels for Microsoft, let's review some key fundamental data. First up is the price to earnings ratio or PE ratio, which compares a company's current share price to its per share earnings. This P.E. ratio falls within the normal range typically seen in established businesses with consistent revenues. On another note, the upcoming earnings report for Q1 2024 is scheduled for April 23, 2024. Analysts, consensus estimates for earnings stand at 284 cents. These figures can have a significant impact on stock prices, so it's worth monitoring closely. Now let's delve into potential day trading levels for Microsoft. In an upward trend, the initial resistance level for Microsoft stands at $4.25. If you're not holding any shares, consider waiting for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For existing shareholders, this could be a point of interest for swing trading. Conversely, Microsoft faces its first support level at $460.42. Should this support hold, it might serve as a favorable entry point with the possibility of a bounce back. The average rating for Microsoft from multiple analyst sources is a strong buy. Now let's delve into some recent insider trades. On March 14, 2024, Rodriguez Carlos A. purchased 514 shares of restricted stock units. On March 14, 2024, Pritzker Penny S. acquired 21,261 shares of restricted stock units. On March 14, 2024, Peterson Sandra E. bought 41,396 shares of restricted stock units. On March 14, 2024, McGregor Catherine invested in 399 shares of restricted stock units. On March 14, 2024, List Terry purchased 39,927 shares of restricted stock units. From the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power is calculated to be negative with a ratio of 36.436. Overall, insiders bought 104,753 shares and sold 197,709 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at 4.2.13, reflecting a decrease of 3.77%. This stock exhibits minimal daily fluctuations, resulting in lower risk. Additionally, a sell signal was identified from a pivot top nine days ago. Is Microsoft stock a good buy? Despite some negative signals indicators, we believe there may be a buying opportunity at today's level. Over the next three months, we anticipate the price to increase. Our analysis shows that the current price of Microsoft stock is undervalued based on recent volatility and movements. For trading on Friday, April 5th, we predict Microsoft will open up at 349 cents and start trading at $421.37. It's important to remember that trading comes with a high risk of losing money. Before making any investment decisions, it's advisable to consult a financial advisor. Please be aware that stockinvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment actions. Presenting our current analysis of the stock.
Share your views in the comments. Do you agree or disagree? Tell us your target price for this stock. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more updates. Wishing you profitable trading and a wonderful day from all of us at Stock Invest.